Hi there, this is Ron Gaioso. I'm the editor of IMCI Magazine. And today, I want to talk to you a little bit about a different article. So let's, let's get started. Uh, so from your Google search, let's go to the magazine, imcimagazine.com. Okay, that's the landing page of the magazine. So I'm going to scroll down and go to Magazine Access, and I'm looking for the July-August edition. When I click on Read, Flip Snack will appear. So now I have the magazine displaying right in front of me. I'm gonna go and maximize my screen so it's comfortable for reading. And then I'm gonna look for the article. Letter from the editor. And then we get to the table of contents. So the article I wanna to talk to you about today is Economic Intelligence for Action. And that we can see on page 15. So let's go there. Okay. So Economic Intelligence for Action was written by Dr. Asia Aslam from Palo Alto Networks. And she talks a little bit about economic indicators. A few things, right? Uh, so they're mostly used to predict uh, changes in the business cycle. Uh, we can think about them in terms of are they global, local, are they industry related? What kind of frequency do we see them? Meaning weekly, daily, monthly, yearly. Uh, how do they relate to your key performance indicators? And how specific are they? Dr. Aslam also uh, took the time to explain the differences between lagging, leading, and coincident indicators. This is a very interesting article. I hope you take the time to take a look at this. Uh, read, share, comment. And if you have any questions, do not hesitate to talk to us. Thank you so much. See you next time.